Welcome, Pisces. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Happy to be back here with you guys. Definitely missed you guys. I've been definitely <laughs> thinking about y'all. Hoping everything is well, guys. I know we're all stuck in the house right now. And trying to get through this, quote unquote. I don't even want to speak the name of it. But y'all know what's going on. Alright, so I also want to let you guys know that currently I am running specials, okay? $44.44 for the remainder of March, okay? The original price for my readings are $67. So $44.44 is going to be is going to get you a full detailed reading as well as a pendulum read, okay? So you're you're gonna get a bonus question for free. Okay, it has to be a yes or no question, and I'll answer it with the pendulum, okay? And it is a full detail reading that comes with guidance and advice, and it answers your questions, okay? So, I only do a certain amount of readings per day, so go ahead and book. That information will be in the drop box below, okay? So, if you're new to my channel, guys, don't forget to subscribe, click the bell, don't forget to... Um, Share with your family and your friends and hit that like button on your way in, all right? So this is going to be for Pisces for the month of April, all right? Um, I definitely apologize if you guys hear the beeping noise in the background. There's absolutely nothing that I can do about it. So it's either don't do videos because of the beeping noise in the back or keep it going. And I'm choosing to keep it moving. So if the beeping annoys you, then you can go listen to someone else, okay? So... Let's hop into it. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right, so let's see what energy is coming towards my Pisces for the month of April. All right, April, April. What messages is there for Pisces? Pisces. Pisces, what message is there for Pisces? What message is there for Pisces, please? What message do you have for Pisces? Some of you Pisces have been worrying, okay? You're coming out of a worrisome situation. There may be a lot of confusion around you. You may be feeling, you know, just kind of confused a little bit, okay? All right, but I feel like... From what I'm seeing here, I feel like <laughs> past energy, you may have been, you know, stressed out a little, worried a little a little bit, um, because there is lots of confusion, okay? There's confusion around what's going on in the world right now. There's just some confusion, okay? You feel confused a little bit. But I do like the future energy. The future energy is the seven of wands. So it looks like you're going to be standing your ground and you're going to be fighting your battles, okay? You're going to be doing whatever. Whatever funk this is that you were just in, you're coming out of it. Strong. All right? I do see someone here stating that they're single, okay? Telling everybody that they're single here. Or you're doing fine. You're doing good. You're doing well. Okay, people may be reaching out to you, asking you if you're okay, how you're doing. You're telling them that you're fine, okay? Let's see. I'm sensing, too, that someone's keeping their word. We got the King of Wands. Oh, lots of sexual energy here. So someone wants to... <laughs> someone wants you bad, okay? Someone is highly attracted to you, Pisces. And someone here is keeping their word, too. We got the Two of Pentacles and the Hier the Hierophant. You could be dealing with a Taurus. But it looks like you guys are definitely aren't too focused or worried. I'm not going to say focused, but aren't too pressured or worried about your finances because it's showing here that you guys are doing well. Okay, so a lot of you Pisces are doing fine financially. You're in a very good place, okay? But I feel like you're, going, you're getting communication from a lot of people. We got the world card. Okay, for some of you guys, you haven't talked, spoken to these people in a while. You know, you, there's chapters that aren't all the way closed. People are just reaching out, you know, and, you know, possibly asking you how you're doing. And you're just keeping people updated. Let's see why the Nine of Swords is here. This is you guys' past energy. I feel like it's in the reverse. But I feel like there's been, like, a little bit of worry or stress 
or anxiety, okay? For some of you guys may have been having a little bit of anxiety. Why is the Nine of Swords here in the past? Okay, the Death card in the reverse. Okay, you, you're done doing something, putting effort into something. Okay, I'm sensing that there needs to be some changes here. Why is the Death card here? Some of you guys could be dealing with the Scorpio. Okay, so you're trying not to worry, okay? I feel like you don't know what's really going on because we got the Two of Swords and the High Priestess in the reverse. You don't, you're not really sure what's going on and maybe you're feeling a little anxious about it, but you're not, I don't feel like you guys were really, you know, terrified. It's just the, you know what, I don't really know or understand what's going on energy. Seven of Cups. In the reverse, okay? Let's see. Something here may seem like an illusion to you, okay? You may feel like something is an illusion, like this isn't real. Something isn't real. You're not sure if it's real, okay? Why is the seven of cups here in the reverse? You're going to wait this out, okay? You're waiting something out. And I feel like as well as... You're looking at different perspectives is what I'm getting as well, too. With this hangman upright and the seven of cups in the reverse, I feel like you're looking at different perspectives. Like, you're, you're, you're not really sure about something, so you're listening to other people's theories, okay? But I feel like moving ahead, seven of wands energy... Okay, you're coming out strong. Why is the Seven of Wands here? I'm getting communication coming in. This has been a long time coming, okay? I feel like you may have been battling. There may have been three people involved here. Okay, I got a three of cups in the reverse. There could have been a third party situation that you possibly could have been battling. Or this could be some type of addiction that you're battling. This could be some type of, um, just something that you could be battling here. I'm sensing that your guards is definitely up. It may be towards some people that may you may have felt like, you know, oh, they're saying that they're my friend, but I don't really know if they're my friend. That type of energy, like, I feel like you're blocking your haters. You're blocking what haters got to say. But I, I, I keep getting this Knight of Pentacles energy for you here. You got the Queen of Cups in the reverse and the Knight of Pentacles upright. Some of you guys, yeah, some type of, someone is com communicating, getting ready to communicate with you. Okay, somebody is getting ready to communicate. And it's been a long time, okay, since you spoke with this person. Um, the opportunity... To come towards you, they've they've seized that opportunity to come towards you, but they they, like I said, it's been a long time coming. We got Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn's energy. This is very slow paced energy. Somebody is sat back for a while, thought about what they wanted to say to you, but communication is getting ready to come towards you. Okay, this could be from somebody that's older. Okay, with the Emperor here, this could be a father that's getting ready to communicate with you. Okay, why's the emperor here? The six of cups. See, yeah, someone's thinking about you, okay, and they decide to reach out, um, and they're wanting to come back around to you. Be careful because they could just be wanting sex. I got the nine of cups and the ace of wands, okay, they could come around for, for that reason in particular, okay. Well, Hermit, you could be dealing with a Virgo. Yeah, this person has been at a distance, okay? And now they're wanting to come towards you and reach out. What action are they going to take towards Pisces?
Let's see what action they're going to take towards you. Because I'm getting that for Pisces, someone is getting ready to reach out to you. Who is reaching out towards Pisces? What do they want? What are their intentions? What do they want from Pisces? What do they want from Pisces? Why are they reaching out now? What do they want from Pisces? Yeah, see, somebody's coming back around, playing around. We got the Knight of Wands in the reverse. They aren't going to stick around. They're coming in quick and they're leaving out quick. This is fire energy. Knight of Wands is very immature, you know, player-like energy. Someone here is a player, okay? Yeah, they're rushing in. Ooh, they're rushing in. They're rushing in. And they're, they're reckless, whoever this is. They're reckless as hell. What do they want from Pisces? Um, they don't have anywhere to go or they're in a bad situation and they're looking for somewhere to go. With this five of pentacles. Okay. Um, ten of swords in the reverse. And the four of wands. For some of you guys, this could be like someone from your past that you had a live-in arrangement. You lived you lived with this person before. This could be family with this four of wands. I'm getting like a divorce as well with this death. I'm sorry, with the Ten of Swords and the Four of Wands. Someone's calling you to get your attention. Okay? Someone's reaching out to you. This is, yeah, there's a separation here. Oh, from a Capricorn. The Devil. <laughs> the Ten of Pentacles. The Four of Swords. There's a separation from somebody that's toxic. Okay? Very, very toxic. The Queen of Wands. Some You could be dealing with a fire sign as well. Fire sign can be involved in this situation. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. But somebody's reaching out to get someone's attention. Okay? So there, here they come running back in. Why is the Five of Pentacles here? Because they just feel rejected, left out in the cold. Yeah. Some of you, for some of you, this person, like, is out of work right now. Okay? They're taking time off from work. Okay, so they're all over the place right now. Why is the Ten of Swords in the reverse? You may have felt backstabbed or betrayed by this person in the past. Okay, Knight of Pentacles again. A lot of you guys dealing with Capricorn. But something has, something did not end, okay? This person may have stabbed you in the back. You felt betrayed by this person. But some type of truth or them reaching out, okay? Some, some, something is getting ready to come out, okay? Why is the Ace of Swords here? I feel like you're getting ready to get some type of clarity. Why is the Ace of Swords here? Yeah. Ooh, somebody's been spying. For some of you guys, I'm getting that there's a marriage here. And someone is dealing with a karmic with this justice in the reverse, okay? Mm. And here they come with their reckless ass, want to rush back in. Why is the four of wands here for future energy? It's in the reverse. So something about, yeah, this is a marriage for a lot of you guys. This is a marriage because someone is still, someone is... Still lying, still being sneaky. Two of Pentacles reverse and a Seven of Swords. Somebody is still juggling, and they're still lying, and they're still doing the most. Okay, they're still doing the most. They're still doing the most. Why is the Ten of Cups here? Six of Wands. They're trying to get the attention back on them. Okay. Um. Oh, somebody's doing some magic here. The magician in the reverse and the moon. Somebody's doing like moon magic or something. Um, but someone's trying to get the attention back on them. Okay. Another sword in the reverse here. What's another sword in the reverse here? Woo. Okay. Mm. You got the hermit. Some of you guys could be dealing with a Virgo. But I'm getting like, there's some really hasty energy, okay? I'm getting lots of playful energy. 
Okay? I'm getting like, stop playing. And sit down. It's what I'm getting. Like, this is literally what it looks like. Like, stop playing. King of Swords is cutting that, cutting that out. And that's the challenge. Okay? So, it's like, stop playing. Stop playing so much. Someone here is doing a lot of playing, running around. I feel like there's unfinished business. Um, but someone is ready to speak their truth. They've been watching you. Why is the page of swords here? Oh, they've been got okay, there's some gossip. Okay. <laughs> All right, so there's definitely been some gossiping going on. Somebody want the truth. Somebody want to hear the truth. Could be dealing with the Capricorn, okay? Something about everybody and somebody business. Woo! Well, what's going on, Pisces? Because, what, did you cut this person off or no? I don't see here with this ten, ten of swords in the reverse. In the reverse, excuse me. Why is the ten of swords reversed here? Oh, somebody regrets something that they said. Queen of Cups, Queen of Swords, Six of Cups. Okay. Somebody spoke their truth or spoke their mind in the past and pissed you off, okay? And maybe there's a cutoff in communication, but somebody heard some, I'm getting rumors or gossip. They wanted to know the truth. They wanted to find out the truth. So here they are coming towards you. Um, I feel like for some of them, are, whoever this person is, they may be out like off of work or taking a break from work because I got the five of pentacles and the three of pentacles here. So somebody's laid off from work or somebody is like, you know, is having, you know, just in a, in a messed up situation right now, looking for work or something to that nature. But it's like, They're trying to get your attention. Why is the Three of Pentacles here? Yeah, somebody is like having financial issues, and they come, and they come bringing their problems to you. Okay. King of Swords. And the Sun card. Could be a Leo. I'm getting Libra, Gemini, Aquarius too. But some truth is coming to light, okay? Somebody here is coming to get the truth. Okay. Wow. Pisces, somebody coming to get the truth. Does somebody want to know the truth about something? They want the truth. And they tired of hearing the rumors. They want the truth. <laughs> they want to hear it from the horse's mouth. They want the truth. They don't want to hear it from nobody else. Answer the call. What is your soul calling you to do, Pisces? What is your soul calling for you to do? The initiation. Rite of passage, crossing the threshold. Hmm. Council of Light. Okay, so this situation has been divinely orchestrated, okay? You having this conversation that's getting ready to come up with this person has been divinely orchestrated, okay? It was meant to happen this way. It's going to happen, okay? It's happening, whether you like it or not. It's happening, okay? <laughs> answer the call. It's so ironic because answer the call and, we're, and I keep saying that. Someone is getting ready to reach out to you. 
divine orchestration. This has been divinely ordered, okay? Let's see what message we have from the angels. And I'm going to skedaddle up out of here. All right, Pisces, let's see. What message do you have for Pisces, please? Get more information, Pisces. Get more information. Be assertive. And like I said, <laughs> perfect timing. Okay. Somebody is trying to maybe trying to get more information about something that they heard about. Okay. But big happy changes is on the horizon for you. A lot of you guys may have been seeing the number 555. Five, five. That's just letting you know, that's the universe way of telling you that things are getting ready to shift. There's a shift, there's a change, okay? But I just feel like, for some reason, I just feel like someone's coming to get more information. Like, they want to know the tea. Oh, see, look, the Hierophant and the Three of Swords. Some of you guys use a separated or something. Why is get more information here? Yeah, see, look, Page of Cups. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody is trying to get more information. That's just what I'm getting. Why is the page of cuts here? Who's trying to get more information? Yep. <laughs> Somebody's probably be planning to come to your house, okay? And they about to bust the like they <laughs> Somebody is planning on coming to your house. Or coming to where they know where you're at. Because they want to get all of the tea. Okay. Be assertive. Be assertive. Ace of Cups in reverse. Ooh, the tower in reverse. Somebody's trying to avoid um, this. Somebody's been trying to avoid this conversation. Okay. It's been taking them a long time. I got King of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, definitely Earth Sign, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. But somebody's been avoiding uh, having this conversation, okay? But I feel like they're ready now with the full um, upright. They've been avoiding it, though, okay? So perfect timing. Six of Cups. See, look, yeah, this person is returning. It's been a long time. It's been a long time, okay? It's been a while, okay? I feel like you were starting to lose patience. They're they're impatient now. Like, they're just like, you know what? F it. <laughs> I'm just going to go ahead and have this conversation with Pisces. Look, Empress, okay? Why is the Empress in the reverse here? Someone could be pregnant, Okay. You may find out that someone is pregnant here. With the Empress and the Star, this could just be that someone feels as if you're very, you know, beautiful, outgoing, whatever, whatever, like you're actually a star, or someone is most definitely pregnant here. Okay. What is the star card here? So somebody's having regrets too. Why is the five of cups in the reverse? Something here about this situation is someone's dealing with a karmic, okay? Someone's dealing with a karmic situation with this justice in reverse, okay? So, for some reason, like, I feel like something is coming full circle. But somebody is dealing with some type of karmic situation, okay? And someone here is possibly having, like, regrets of doing something that they had no business doing. Something about their past, okay? They've been avoiding this. But I feel like they're coming to get more information. They've heard something about you. They heard a rumor about you. That's what I'm getting. Like they heard something about you or they heard from word of mouth. They may have been asking about you um, and they're just trying to get more information. But they've been watching you as well. And they're trying to get more information. I feel like they're coming to get that information, Pisces. All right. So I hope this message was helpful for you guys. And if you want to book your very own personal reading, guys, information is in the drop box below. 
And don't forget to like, comment, and share with your family and friends. Until next time, bye-bye.